3,285. 4,745. 2,190. 5,992. 839. 731. 2,190. 30 days. My day starts with uh, checking uh, on what are the cars which will be going uh, today. Which well, my day starts, uh, I, uh, I come in a, a little earlier, 8.30. Uh, that's basically just for me to plan. My, my day starts about 8.45 a.m. every morning. Uh, I come in, check my emails, make sure everything's been accounted for. My days at the store um, pretty much start off with me coming in, I punch in. We have a cool little fingerprint scanner in there. My day starts with me coming in every day at about 9 o'clock and checking out what new cars we have. I think the first thing I do for the day is I try to figure out how we can generate business. What can we sell today? My day starts off at being here around 7.15, 7.10, and I'm here with the shop foreman, open up the front doors. My day starts with coffee, obviously. My day starts with obviously all the sales team holding around me to ask for the approvals. My day starts with me coming in and being greeted by uh, our receptionist, Brittany. So it, it feels like a family, you know what I mean? We you know, you could see where that family came from. And even though we've grown and doubled. Uh, the dealership is like a family. Of course, there's no perfect family. So there's obviously going to be some quabbles here and there. It's pretty awesome, man. Like, uh, I, I, as I said before, I'm pretty new. Um, everybody starts in when you walk in the door, everybody's saying hi. They know you by your first name. It, it's pretty awesome, Mike. It's very welcoming, very warm, very friendly. You know, our, our, our staff, we still try to maintain that family um, feeling uh, at Mississauga Hyundai. It's day one. I'm walking out with my brand new 2016 Tucson Black Ash with a 43 inch flat screen TV. Can I get a whoop whoop? <laughs> Who wants to see my TV? Come see my TV. These guys are, have been the best. I've already given out business cards to people at work. Hey, customer. I will always come back to this place Wonderful. without fail. Wonderful. And I will Love fight. It. it will Ever. follow these two wherever they go. So, Mr. Mati, please, please keep, keep them it. on board. <laughs> and they deserve a raise. A big, big, big one. who are on their second, third, and fourth vehicle from Mississauga Hyundai. It's great because I, I love talking to them because they actually give me, they, they help me uh, do what I do. They, they, they bring that, that satisfaction that everything that we do, when they come back and says, you know, we love it here, uh, your staff is great, Mike, uh, that, that really makes it all worthwhile for me, that what the things we're doing is really, really beneficial. And that's one of the things what we're trying to do is we're trying to basically not, as I tell our sales, our, our sales team, oh, when, I talk to, when I talk to some customers whenever I'm on the floor, is that we're not here to sell you one car. We're here basically to earn your loyalty uh, for as long as you need a vehicle. Uh, yeah, there definitely is a family. You feel the connection with everybody. Uh, everybody's pretty straightforward, um, do their jobs and gets along. But everybody tries to find a way to make it work together. That's a good, that's a good thing about this dealership is that everybody puts in their input and everybody um, tries to see the whole 
picture rather than just narrowing it down on one specific thing. The core of the team has been together at least six, seven, ten years, so it feels like a family, you know what I mean? We go uh, visit each other sometimes, you know, try to go uh, bowling, you know, do, do things that, you know, family, family does. We have our little trips. Just the other day we went to do actually bowling as well here at the Classic Bowling. The days of yesterday at Hyundai were the most exciting and rewarding experiences that I've ever had. The days of tomorrow are autonomous driving vehicles, they're fuel cell vehicles without uh, pollution. So what a success story Hyundai uh, really is and was, um, and I think as with any car manufacturer, it starts with product, it starts with quality. Uh, we're transforming. Uh, the brand is growing up. We're becoming more mature, we're becoming more premium. But I think more importantly, uh, we're seeing our, our demographics shift wildly. Uh, our country's demographics are shifting wildly. But at the end of the day, it starts with good people to be able to uh, deal with the public, deal with the communities, and uh, be able to service those customers that uh, put their faith in Hyundai. And uh, as people from all nations and all cultures uh, from outside of Canada are flocking to Canada, uh, we have to adjust to that and we have to understand the importance of diversity in everything that we do. One of the most outstanding examples of people that do that are the people at Mississauga Hyundai and Nav Magic. And I believe that's where someone like Nav who's out on the front lines for us, who really understands the customers, the importance of diversity, and the direction that we're headed as a company is so important for the growth of Hyundai. NAV is, honestly speaking, it's not a dealer principle to me. NAV is a wonderful human being. NAV is one of a kind. NAV is, is, is quite a story. He's a cool guy. Like, he knows you by first name. He comes in, he says hi to everybody. He's got so much energy. NAV is the future of Hyundai. Uh, the future of Hyundai is a whole lot different than today and definitely different than yesterday. Part of the reason I chose to come work at Mississauga Hyundai was because of Nav. I heard his story, what he's done. He's just like an elder of the family, the leader of this uh, family. He's just not a car dealer. He's uh, much more than a, than a car dealer, although he's one of the best car dealers, or is the best car dealer that Hyundai has, or has had. Um, for the last 30 years. So we're excited to uh, uh, say that, yeah, NAV has been one of the biggest, most important dealers we've had in the past, but I think more importantly is he's gonna be one of the most important influential figures for Hyundai in the future. This dealership is like a small, not a small family, it's a large family actually. And I've been taken into the family with open arms. I've only been here for about six months now, but everyone's treated, I feel like I've known these guys for my entire life. The, the, I mean, this, I've been at this store for 13 years, so I really don't know a lot with, that goes outside these, 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 these glass windows. But I do know this, that out there there's a lot of you know, big auto groups that are buying up stores. This is the exact opposite of that and I think it always will. And it's one of the reasons why I love this, this place. I love coming to work. It is a family store. Well, my day never really ends. Uh, it's a continuous, uh, in my mind, I'm always thinking about how we can improve our customer uh, service, how we can engage our, our employees a bit more. Uh, 
I think my day ends when I know that I've done absolutely everything I can. And I know that sounds like a, like a probably a cheesy metaphor, but I really feel that. I've done everything I can. I've packed it into one work day and it's, it's time to shut it down, but it feels good. So that's how my day ends. So my day ends with sending customers home happy with their new cars. And that's probably the best part. So how my day ends? When you work for Mississauga Hyundai, your day never ends. So you always have Mississauga Hyundai in your mind, even in your sleep. Uh, so it's an ongoing, every time you go somewhere, you know, and you see an ID, you're always wondering how can we implement this stuff? So really and truly, it's, it, it's really, I um, don't want to be facetious, but really it's an ongoing thing. It just rolls into the next day. We hope to see you soon at Mississauga Hyundai, where every day is a Hyundai. That's a funny question because who would really give thought to it? I mean, when you come to work, you do, you're do you supposed to put on your professional side and then you treat the position with 100% of energy and dedication. But when the clock strikes, 5 o'clock, 6 o'clock, or whatever, when the time closes, hey, it schools out, we're out. Thanks. Wow. <laughs> that's awesome. That. Funny. That's awesome. I guess. Nav is in the wrong sport. He should be following tennis. <laughs> <laughs>